Good morning and welcome to another auto vlog video. Some of you might be wondering where I'm at. I'm actually in Wisconsin between Milwaukee and Green Bay. Check out the nice view we have here. So thanks to Pencil, myself, and a couple other YouTubers are here. And today we are going to Road America. It's going to be awesome action-packed a lot of motorsports we're gonna be in the pits we're gonna talk to drivers so let's go <laughs> well, damn! This is basically what we do here. That's our office. <laughs> While you guys have the computer, you know, the camera, we have the steering wheel. That's our computer. So basically, um, that's what we're playing in the There's a lot of buttons here that I still don't know what the heck they would do. <laughs> but one though, I know, it's the radio. So this is it's because it's written right here. We have the radio. We have the uh, pit lane speed, so every time you come in, you actually uh, tell them, okay, you press that, it automatically sets up to a uh, 60 kilometer. 60 kilometers uh, is a uh, fixed speed limit. This is flashlight, so when you're behind someone, you like get out of my way. That's what we do. S similar in the traffic, you know, we're like, hey, buddy. <laughs> As you can see, there is a lot of buttons, and you're going about 100, maybe 109 miles an hour, and they're telling you, Delta Mode 3, you're like, what? <laughs> so, it's fresh for me that sometimes when they say, I say, I, I can't be here, okay, give me, let me drive, let me drive. <laughs> it is a lot of fun, I mean, the car is obviously different than in the car. I've been driving in the car for 20 years. This year, we're, we're uh, with the Penzoil at Indy 500. And uh, the big difference is in the car, you don't have the roof on top of it. Yeah. Now here you have like a yeah. windshield, a roof. Yeah. It's actually, you drive with the visor open. And uh, it's kind of like, because you don't need it. You know, there is no air coming through, so it's just normal. Uh, it's a pretty cool machine. All right, so here we are. We are down in the paddocks, and we just got a personal tour by Team Penske, and we met the legend himself, Elio Castroneves. Absolutely amazing. Just check this place out here. We're, of course, going to go see some races later on in the video, but there's so much to see here. Turbocharged Lamborghinis. We got Rob Dom. We have Smurfin WRX over here, and we have the humble mechanic right over there. Awesome YouTubers here you guys need to check out if you haven't already. So, GTLM. The cars you see here are effectively the same cars that race at Le Mans. Okay. Um, this, this, our M8 is our first pure GT car. We race in GTLM, which is a basic only class, but they are, all the cars are built to uh, Le Mans specs. So, this is Jesse Crone, Alexander Sims, Connor. Have you guys been in any races before? No, first time for me. This guy, I'll never forget, told me on a ride to Mechanicsburg, your Honda dealership, he said, I said, Bob, what's it going to be like out of the car? Retired 97, not in the car. He said, Schneider, I believe life starts at 40. And I'll never forget that. You said, I got these business plans, I'm going to do this, I'm going to do that. And sure enough, there we are. Team owner, a couple of quality series. Yeah. And, oh, it's, it's great. Passes about 60% of that. So what what do these cars weigh? I mean, so running weight, uh, running weight without a driver is right around two thousand pounds. Two thousand? Yeah. Um, right now the DPI cars are making probably in the mid five hundreds, and then the white cars are six hundred. 
So this is about 600. Uh, this is, we're, we're in the mid 500. Mid 500s, okay. But for 2,000 pounds, yeah, that's pretty good yeah. power to weight ratio. Yeah. And the, so the sports cars are generally more efficient. So even though we make less horsepower than any car, like right. the top speeds are pretty similar. Oh, okay. Uh, the efficiency of the car, the fact that the wheels are covered, we don't make as much drag. Right, 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 right. It's all about aerodynamics. God, what I would give to drive a car like that. Just know, one yeah. lap, one lap. I mean, preferably a hundred, but just one lap. That would be <laughs> awesome. So we were just talking to John, who is the lead engineer for Team Penske. Now, Team Penske, they race in the prototype class. We were here earlier in the video, but we got some interesting facts regarding power to weight ratio. These cars weigh around 2,000 pounds, and they make around 550 horsepower. 550 horsepower doesn't sound like all that much nowadays, but these cars are all about aerodynamics and weighing 2,000 pounds. You guys can imagine how fast these cars are. Pretty similar top speed to an Indy car, actually. The wheels are covered, so they don't get as much drag on the tires. This is just very, very interesting being in here. The environment of a race team, it's, it's just amazing. Now these cars also run on off-the-shelf Pennzoil oil, which is pretty interesting. Pretty cool meeting uh, Elio Castroneves as well. And out there, they're currently having a, uh, a signing where I got to see Juan Pablo Montoya. And being European, where Formula One is everything, I remember him as a Formula One driver. So we're currently at turn 13 right here and we're watching three different classes the prototypes the gtlm and the gtd listen listen Hi guys, so we are back from an amazing event at Road America. I want to give a special thanks to Pennzoil for inviting me and having me experience IMSA racing for the first time. It was very, very cool to see three different classes of cars race at the same time. Now, while we were there, we got to meet with Team Penske. We talked to the engineers. We also talked to some of the drivers. One of them was Elio Castroneves. So I don't even know if I'm pronouncing the guy's name right but that was probably the highlight of the whole trip. Another very interesting thing that we found out was that those cars, which are endurance race cars that go on for over two hours straight at very high speeds, they use the same type of off-the-shelf oil that you and I can buy for our vehicles. There's no specific secret race blend that no one else gets to take part of. They use Pennzoil's Ultra Platinum Synthetic Zero W40. Now another cool thing is that if you go to Pennzoil's website, pennzoil.com, they actually have an oil selector where you can find the specific oil for your specific vehicle. And that's what I did. So when it's time for my next oil change, I know what I'll be using. This is a specific oil for a 5 liter V8 F150. And it started raining. <laughs> Like many times when you film a uh, video in Pittsburgh, PA, weather changes in a second. But I do hope you guys enjoy this video. Definitely check out Pennzoil.com and their oil selector to find the right oil for your car. And if you're stopping by this channel for the first time and you haven't already and you want to, please subscribe and I'll see you guys very, very soon. Bye-bye.